Hello friends, I am going to show you how to change the version of your DWG file when someone sent to you by mail or suddenly you just want to change it on your cell phone because here I am going to show you how to convert or change the format of your AutoCAD file in another version. For example, when someone send you a file in AutoCAD 2016 or 2018 but we have the 2012 or 2014 version, and we want to open it on this computer to be able to work on it, and we do not have the option. Here I am going to show you another option on how to do it through your Android cell phone, since I previously made another video on how to do the same, but with one with a Windows program and also an option online. Also later in this video I am going to show you another option with a free viewer that also saves and changes the format. So in this first part of the video, I'm going to show you how to do it from your Android cell phone. So here I am giving an example. When someone send me an email, I need to see it and also change the format. This file is in a 2018 version and I need is to change it to 2014, then I'm going to start downloading it. This is an example. They can also download files from the cloud, for example if they have Google Drive or Microsoft OneDrive, also you can download their files that they have loaded or recorded in the cloud. I already downloaded it, and now I go to the program that is here, that is in the middle, the name is DWG FastView, you can download it from the Google Play Store or App Store. You can have the latest version without problems. Then I also open in this program, a user can be created, it has other options. But this time I haven't created any user. I'm going to local. I'm going to download and here is my file as you can see. It gives me a 3D preview, then I'm going to open it, as you can see it's 2018. I'm going to put edit mode, note that if you just want to see it for any other need you may have, it can be choose view mode or I can choose edit mode, to be able to record in another format, I choose editing, and here is my file. Then the only thing I'm going to do, is here, in DWG FastView to save, and save as. I'm going to put it here, in the root, and also in download, I'm going to put it. Okay, and here I am going to change the name, then choose a 2014 version. This is simply the name, but I am going to create it. Here is where you can choose the 2004 version and I am going to put it in 2004. 2004 version. Place in any of these versions, 2013, 2010, 2004. Here is 2004, the DWG DXF option. 2004 version, OK. And voila, I have successfully saved it. And I'm going back to this. Well here is an example with 2014, but I have put it in 2004, I save it in an older version. Here I click on reply. And attached my file. Here it is, this is my file in the 2004 version. And I send it. And maybe he sent it to me as well and I can save it on my computer, and be able to open it with AutoCAD with whatever version it was, and there would be no problem. I'm going to switch to the computer, and I'm going to open this file. Here is the file that I received, that I sent it to, and here I can download it and open it without any problem. I am going to download it, and I am going to open it. It shows me that it has not been created with an Autodesk program, but it is a program that also works with DWG, so I give it to continue, okay. 
And it is a good alternative if you want to quickly change the format and do not have time to maybe download a program or get a machine that has AutoCAD 2018, 2020 and be able to make the change in AutoCAD. Then this is a good option. Now the second option, as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, is an online one, and the second is here, DWG FastView for Web from StarCAD, then they simply click on Open Drawing File, select a local file, then I will save this, for example 2013, if it comes out like this, that the Adobe Flash Player is blocked, you simply go to the padlock and in Flash, allow the flash to run, clicking allow and it will automatically restart, a reload is better, also for example if you are in Firefox. You can get a black screen, test if you have the flash installed, you click on check now, they tell you that unfortunately it is not installed, you have to download it, here they give you a procedure to download. Let's click there, it also recommends deactivating this, if not you will also install these options in Firefox, deactivate them, and install the flash for your Firefox, but in Chrome it is already preloaded, you only have to unlock it. There he opened it, as you can see, it does not have the finishes that the drawing has, but the important property it has is, save as, and they can convert it to another format, for example 2013, and they click on 2010, and they click on save. Here also taking advantage, you have the option to export to PDF or image or print as well. They are good applications, and here when it finishes they click on download, and I save it in 2010. And download it. Click OK, and I'm going to open it from Windows Explorer, here is the file that I created in 2010. Click Open. It tells me that it is obviously not done in AutoCAD, but it can be opened. And voila there is the 3D file. Well, this is one of the options, obviously the best option, is that of Autodesk itself. But if you have these tools and need them to make a change or urgent transformation, you can use them either online or from your cell phone. Well that would be all if you like it, click on like, you can also share this video with your friends or colleagues, subscribe to the YouTube channel to receive updates on the videos. I invite you to subscribe to the social media pages of this channel. And have a great day, thanks for watching.